and today I am going to talk about my booklet that is published by Pulitzer Science. It is related to history optional mapping notes, and in this one we have especially included. Hello everyone, welcome to Pluto Science. I am Jitendra Kumar, and today I am going to talk about my booklet that is published by Pluto Science. It is related to history optional mapping notes, and in this one we have especially included more than 300 sites. So let us see that what is the most important feature of this book. Before that, I will tell you that why history mapping is very important for the history optional examination. Or let us when. This is important because as you can see that in the history optional examination for UPSC civil service examination, there are two papers, each of 250 marks. One paper, paper one is of ancient and medieval India, whereas paper two is about modern India and world history. Each of the paper has a 250 marks. Out of that in paper one especially, the 50 marks questions have been asked on the mapping only. So there is a one question in which there are 20 sites have been included in the map of India. In these 20 sites, especially the students and the aspirants are expected to identify those 20 sites given on the map of Indian subcontinent and identify after identifying this, they are expected to write about 30 words. Okay, so in this booklet, what we have done, we have included more than 300 important sites as per the PYQ taken from the 1979 onwards. So from 1979 to 2023, whatever the sites have been included in the history optional mapping examination, we have included these all sites, the most important sites. There are more than uh, there are more than 50 sites who have been repeatedly asked more than five to six times. मतलब अगर आप एक बार एक trend analysis देख लेते हैं, you will identify that which sites are the most important. So what we have done in this our history optional mapping booklet, we have included and identified all these sites. We have divided this into 27 chapters. If you see these chapters, you will come to understand that. The first chapter is Homonid fossil site. Let's say there are four important sites of this topic. So what we have done, we have included those sites. We have included these sites in the mapping also, and then we have written a detailed analysis of this one. For example, chapter one is Paleolithic period. Okay, in these Paleolithic sites, we have included about 35 sites. These are the nature. You can see this one in this board. You can see this that these are the detailed explanation of each site. So the important stone sites are pure explanation. Hai. And then in the next page, you will follow that these are the mapping. So as per the serial number which is mentioned in the chapter two, Paleolithic sites, these have been included here in the map as you can see. In this map, what you find, we have serial number 11, 9, then suppose that this is uh, Vimbetka, then this is uh, Adamgad. These are the important sites are very important which are included in all of these things. For example, if you see these sites, this may be important the sites if you see Ajmer, five number is Ajmer which was a Hathra Basin. This is a very important sites. So in the mapping, these sites have been included in the Ajmer regions. Okay. Then for example, we have the other chapters I have taken for 22 chapters. You know that UNESCO World Heritage Site is very important. And repeatedly this question have been asked recently last year only. If you see 2023, the two important things have been included into the UNESCO World Heritage Site. That is one is the Santin Ketan, other is the Hoysala Temples. Hoysala Temples are at three important city of Karnataka. One is Heluvadu, that is Dwar Samundar, then Belur and then Somnathpura. So this question can be asked in the mapping examination. Mapping me is Sal, those are obviously history optional men's me. A question puche ja sakte hai student hai na. So we have included all those 42 sites in the mapping. So here is a description of all these 42 sites, Ajanta Caves, Elora Caves, Agra Fort and all. And in this mapping, here is a map, you can see that we have identified the location of all these sites uh, in Pura mein mapping karke Pura India mein map mein banaya gaya hai. So there is a good benefit of this mapping. Uh, if you want to purchase this book, uh, you can feel free to contact us through the YouTube channel. You can comment on the link also. We will, our team will reply to you. Or you can also consult Pura's IS uh, support team. 
टू गेट दिस बुक अगर आप ये बुक चाहते हैं तो आप प्लूटस आई से कंसल्ट कर सकते हैं और प्लूटस आई एस विल हेल्प यू एट ऑल द प्लेटफॉर्म लेट मी अगेन टेल यू दैट वाट इज द स्पेसिलिटीज ऑफ दिस बुक इस बुक का जो स्पेसिलिटीज है द मैपिंग ऑफ मोर देन थ्री हंड्रेड इम्पोर्टेंट साइट्स डिटेल एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ ऑल साइट्स ट्रेन एनालिसिस ऑफ लास्ट थर्टी ईयर्स फ्रॉम नाइनटीन सेवेंटी नाइन ऑन वर्ड्स प्रैक्टिस ऑफ पी वाई क्यू साइट्स अलॉन्ग विद सोल्यूशन ऑफ द पी वाई क्यू साइट्स एंड इट हैज अ टोटल ट्वेंटी सेवन टू ट्वेंटी एट चैप्टर्स आर इंक्लूडेड सो यू कैन परचेज दिस बुकलेट फ्रॉम द पुट प्लूटस आई एस सपोर्ट टीम अपार्ट फ्रॉम इट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू प्रिपेयर हिस्ट्री ऑप्शनल विद मी स्पेशली आई एम टीचिंग हेयर एट द प्लूटस आई एस आई एम हिस्ट्री फैकल्टी हेयर I have been PhD from JNU and I have been working in the University of Delhi as assistant professor. Teaching, I am teaching here as history optional and GS paper. If you want to prepare with me, especially for history optional, let me tell you that if you give me four hour for the next five month, you will be done with your history optional and you will score more than sixty percent. Here, what do we offer? You have to give two hour, five days a week in lecture. and then 2 hour at self study at your home so 2 hour lecture plus 2 hour self study you will be able to complete your history optional preparations what do we do we cover all the syllabus in the 2 hours 5 days and the week days so these are the details of our institute you can consult to us you do not have to read anything except my study material that is given to you in the class that is handouts and plus ppts so if you focus on the ppts plus the study material provided by me at plutus is you will not have to read anything but of course you are recommended to read one book that is the standard test book you can read if you want to explore and understand more in detail that is the ancient india rs sharma medieval india satish chandra modern india you can read sekhar bandhu baate world history you can read normal law so these are the important text book let me tell you my notes on the world history is very comprehensive you do not need to refer any book if you read my notes at Uh, of Plutus IS of the World History. Okay, so when, so if you want to purchase this book, if you want to get this uh, book, if you have soft copy, so you again no problem. You can contact my support team. You will get this booklet. Okay, this is a very interesting booklet, and also you can join with us at a Plutus IS for the understanding of this booklet. Okay, so when, so we'll see you in the other video. Thank you.